Hey there fellow Zoopsters, and welcome back to the channel for a brand new episode, so let's get to it and welcome to the zoo. Hello, Golden Nyx. What a beautiful skin. And now we're in the store. We've just teleported there for some reason. Hello, Nyx. We're actually rather close to Grandmaster 1 with Nyx. That's pretty cool. Now, let's go and collect some stuff. What do you think about that? And... Yeah, there are eight hours until the season ends, so we might as well grab as much stuff as we can. So, we're gonna collect some good old points here, and maybe, just maybe... Well, there it is, there's a tier. Tier 27, but it doesn't really get better the more tiers you get, unfortunately. But that is tier 30, undoubtedly. Alright, let's get out of the battle pass and go to the store. What are we gonna get in the store? Well, we might as well just see if there's anything cool, and... Some limited time special offers. That is a really good offer though. Times 12 value. That's awesome. Actually, you have all the event items. Really cool. Apart from the bandages though. Where are the bandages? Hmm. That's pretty weird. Let's let's get this reward here. Some four Yara tokens. Might as well get them. Because they're free. They free? Nothing for Elaine though. That is rather disappointing. It would have been really, really nice, actually. And of course, you can still get clues out of crates. Ooh, legendary crate offer. That's neat. Either way, you can still get them clues out of crates, which is really, really cool. So you can uh, unlock some really sick rewards. Even a free black crate. The event is still going on, and it's awesome. The nine, the nine clues. I, I'm guessing they're really rare, of course, but that is a free black crate, so that's awesome. And while we're at it, how about let's how about how about we add this little beauty to our collection, the third clue that we have right here. We have collected it, and let's see. I mean, we're gonna get um, an Elaine emote, you know, the detective Elaine emote. Yes, we will get that actually, because we unlocked one. <laughs> one of these, just one clue, so we're guaranteed to get that, that's for sure. Okay, what other emotes are, are we gonna use? Okay, I really like this muscle one. I'm a fan of that one. And the Elaine skin, good vibes Elaine. But we'll see about that, of course. We're just at, uh, <laughs> we're at level 9 at the moment, so we're not quite there yet, as you can see. But we're getting close to that skin. Pretty close! Well, today, here's what we're gonna do with Elaine. I was thinking, how about we do something fun with the lane since we haven't exactly done that in quite a while now. And it is the noob versus the pro challenge. Alright, it's Elaine's turn. And let's have some fun here with the stealth huntress. Now first of all, let's change our items a bit. So we're gonna go for the most newbie of newbie 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 items. And of course we're gonna use a drone lane shot. And I don't like that item. Clown knows, because it's in the name, and our last item is gonna be is gonna be Doctor's Coat because well we're not gonna play a team game mode and we might as well use you know an item that's useless. Because only a noob would use the useless item in this game mode, I guess. So we might as well just use that. Pretty cool stuff. Alright. And let's play some soul standard. Of course the skins, we're not gonna change the skins if you have no skins to change. So let's just battle and see how it goes in the noob way. And then we're gonna do the pro way. You know how it goes. Let's get it! And here we are, Mr. Legendary Guard, how are you? Okay, you know what? I have a better idea, how about we get out of here, right? Because the Legendary Guard is a very scary fella, and he has a lot of HP and damage output, and very scary, that's how it goes. So we might as well just not go next to the Legendary Guard. Again, it's the noob challenge for now, so you get what I'm saying. Of course! We're definitely gonna get very up close and personal with this Bruce because that's the best way to tackle him. Not from a distance, but to get right next to him. Obviously. <laughs> Can't find a different way to fight Bruce. I mean, that's how you do it. We're gonna use the bow at short range, obviously. <laughs> that's what the noob does. That's, that's the point. So don't get angry for this. And finally, I don't believe it. I just got a kill. <gasps> Incredible. I don't believe it! That's what the noob would say. Probably. And now, of course, to assert our dominance, let's roam around in a barrel, obviously. Let's see how this goes. Imagine you're walking around, searching for players, as you always do. You see a barrel, of course, it's not that threatening. And then it just jumps at you. And the lane jumps out of it. That is very terrifying. Okay, that's a Milo. We might as well get out of here, because we're gonna die! Hmm. 
Okay, maybe not. Maybe we're just gonna steal this. <laughs> you just stole a shotgun. We're good, though. Oh, no! We're not gonna jump at the Ravi because he's really powerful at close range. Believe me. Trust me. The Bok, though, is great to tackle at close range. He is very weak. He is very weak. Man, I wish I had vampire teeth. But it's the noob challenge, so... No vampire teeth! Okay, let's go. Eat. And no, maybe, maybe there's no one there. Okay, fair enough. I guess we're gonna get away! And maybe that Larry is onto us. Perhaps he is. I think he is. I mean, why wouldn't he be? He's invisible, roaming around. Somewhere. But we can't see him, obviously, because he's invisible. Well... We might as well just roam around looking for extra players. Extra bucks and bruises to get at at close range because they are very vulnerable to close range attacks. They always are. They're not. But for now, they are. Alright. And the Ravis, the Betsies, the Nixes, nah. They are very strong at close range. Ooh, close range target. What do you think? Rawr! Raw, we're gonna use the bow at close range, the most powerful weapon for close range attackers. Raw. Obviously. Oh no, how did I die? Because noob, obviously. Because it's the noob challenge. And now, I think it's time to shift our focus, of course. On to the pro. The pro leagues, the elite. And see how this turns out, of course. So let's go back to the menu and obviously change our items. Because why not? Okay, changing our items is definitely going to help us quite a little bit. So let's go to the items. If they're going to load, obviously. Because if they're not, then we're not going to go to the items. Okay, they loaded. Sick. Let's get the Vampire Teeth for extra HP. Uh, jungle Shoes, because it just works. And... Kill him canister? No. We're, I think we're going to go for Holy Sandals. I think that's going to work. Yeah, I feel like this is a great combo for pretty much any character. But it's definitely not newbie. It's a good combo. And it's going to work. So... Let's go for some battles and try to get as many kills as possible, because this is the pro time. Let's go. And now we're loading. Of course. Why wouldn't we? Do you know the way? And let's go to this Mr. Actually, no, the legendary guard, obviously. Okay, maybe not. Maybe to this normal guard. And yes, I think you did see it. And I also saw it as well. There was a Jack, and he still is around here. There's a jack around here. This is a great source of panic. Oh no! We're definitely going to die. No, maybe not. Maybe we are, maybe we're not. That's the thing. That's what's most what's most fun. Okay, that's a boost. I know I said you should engage in them with in, in, in combat. In close range combat. In the noob version. In the noob match, but this isn't the noob match, this is the pro match, so for now we're gonna play it safe and get out of here. Cause you don't just fight a Bruce in bushes. <laughs> Cause it's gonna turn out bad, look at him. It's, it's another one. Is it, it's, is it the same one? Probably. I mean, there are Bruce's everywhere, of course. Look at that, a Nyx. Oh, we're gonna use the bushes to our advantage. And we're gonna go like this. And we're gonna go like this, and dash, and BAM! Shotgun hit. That's how you get to your target. It's difficult. It really is, because it's a Nyx, and Nyx has the dash. So here's what we do. I think the Nyx went this way. Oh, that's that's the Nyx. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna use this for our advantage. The arrows actually came in really clutch right now. I love that. We're gonna jump once again, and bam! Destruction. Oop. Okay, we don't exactly have healing. We don't have happy treats on this character, so we might as well just use a med kit and call it a day. Yep, fair enough. I love the full HP, and there's no one here. Hmm, fair enough. Okay, that Bruce though is just level 5, I have no HP, so it makes perfect sense to just destroy him. Obliterate him! Explode him into a thousand pieces! Bam! And we're still alive, of course, because we're playing in the new boy, I mean the pro way. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, a lot of legendary weapon enthusiasts around here, but I don't see them anywhere. There's also a fae around here somewhere. Or there was a fae around here somewhere. Hmm. Okay, that's a Nyx. It's probably the level 6 Nyx we were trying to defeat a little while ago. And this Nyx also 
has the legendary weapon. Well, well, well. I'm not surprised. Of course it's the Nyx. It's obviously the Nyx. And the legendary weapon as a bow is kind of awkward because the bow is just a bit awkward for Elaine. Always has been. So it's going to be kind of strange to use, but we'll work it out. It's going to be fine. And what better way to use the walls than just do this? I mean, it's so satisfying every single time. I love it. Okay, let's grab this medkit, which, which has just been placed here by the gods. And that's a definitely not Fei Fei. Absolutely not Fei Fei. That's pretty much the name. Level 14. Okay, I get it. I get it! You're super strong! Right, eventually we're gonna have to try to defeat that Fei. Almost said he lame for some reason. Okay. The Fei is here, pretty much. Hiding would be our best bet right now. Because that's a level 14 Fei who absolutely shouldn't be here. I'm reminding you. That doesn't work. Is level 9 powerful right now? Yes. Is level 14 overpowered? Yes. It is. Okay, legendary weapon. Did nothing. It's very awkward to use. And I think our best bet right now would be to just attack anyone else apart from the Fei. Which also has low HP. Hmm. Who should we attack? Oh, yes. Holy sandals, of course. Alright, we have a shield. Let's use the shield. Extra HP. And this is it! This is the battle. The battle. In which we'll be finding out who's gonna win. Is it gonna be the Fey? I don't know. Depends. On who's better. Okay, we're dealing damage here. We're dealing damage. We're also flying, of course. And we're not dead. Fantastic. Come on, okay. Whoa, what is that? That surprised me. And we're dead. Oh, God. It's weird. Your whole screen gets covered up by ink. Okay, I played this game quite a lot. But Faye doesn't really do that all that much. I don't see that many Faye's roaming around. Just weirdly walking, because that's what the Faye does. I don't know why, but Faye just walks in such a goofy way. It's very goofy. I love it. But either way, that was a solid match, so GG's. Rank 2. I mean, our opponent was very strong, and we did manage to put up, put up a fight there, so it worked out okay. At least we got some pretty good trophies out of that. So GG, Mrs. Faye, but I will be looking for you in the next match. And who knows what character I will be using in the next match. Maybe a level 17 Jade. <laughs> Either way, that was a pretty fun video, I have to say. Sadly, we are going to have to end it off here, but it was cool. It was very cool. The new versus pro challenge with Elaine went pretty well. I really like that. Elaine is such a cool character in general. And at level 9, she's still really strong. I mean, not against level 14 phase, obviously, but a lot of fun to play. Always has been. And it's so cool. We're definitely going to get more trophies with Faye. And it's just a lot of fun. Well, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Maybe comment down below something for the algorithm. That would be absolutely sick. Maybe like a video idea or something. That would be awesome. And I'd see you. I'll see you in the next one, fellow Zoopsters. I'll see you in the zoo. And have a lovely day, fellas. Goodbye.